Welcome back to another edition of Fly Tying with Jim Ashura. Today I'm going to tie a Hemingway Caddis Flimp. The hook that I have in the vise is a standard dry fly hook and this is a size 16. I'm going to use some 8 aught black thread and I'm going to start the thread behind the eye and I'm going to bring it back to where it would hang at the barb of the, of the hook. When I'm fishing caddis I like to have I like to have them riding right in the film. That's why I use a lot of flimp style caddis. First thing we're going to do is put on the body and for the body I'm going to make it olive. This is just super fine dubbing. I'm going to turn my vise slightly so I can have room to get my fingers in there. My fingers are a little, every little crack catches the dubbing. Get that in there. Put just another little piece on there. And we're going to wind this forward. Make a pudgy little body there. As we're going. Might have to put some more on. Get a little bit more on there. You can always add more like you're seeing now. You can always add more. Pain in the neck taking it off. And we're going to stop about just about two eye lengths from the eye of the hook. Now for the wings I'm going to use Hemingway premium fly tying and these are caddis wings and these are gray and they're small. Just going to take one and pop one out. There we go. Just going to pop one out. I'm going to fold it in half. And we're going to put that on the on top and secure that pretty well. Now I'm going to take a I'm going to take a brown CDC feather and if you get a nice CDC feather that the stem isn't too thick I would suggest that you tie it in by the tip and just wrap it like that if you have a thick stem then you have to use your dubbing block put the CDC in a dubbing loop go ahead and secure that I'm just gonna fold that back those little wisps that's not gonna be much yeah maybe I'll cut that one off Come on, what's wrong with my eyes here? Here we go. Now I'm going to put my hackle pliers on there. Let me use my delicate hackle pliers. And we're going to go ahead and wind this. You're going to wind almost the whole feather if we could. And I'm going to get that one around. There we go. And I'm going to trim off that excess right there. Not quite enough to hold it and use the poke and snip on. 
I'm going to pull everything to the back, make a head, take the whip finish, yeah, I give it anywhere from three to five, and pull that tight. Take some head cement, clean the brush off well. And now if you want, you could go ahead and just break those off just around the length of the wing or maybe a little bit longer. This is going to float well. You're going to have that wing laying right on the water. And here we have a Hemingway CDC Caddis. Hope that you learned something from this video. Hope that you would subscribe to my channel. Please refer me to your friends. Please visit my sponsors. If you'd like to uh, purchase any flies, that I make, go to etsy.com slash shop slash the flyman gym. Please leave comments, questions, suggestions, and most of all, thank you very much for watching my videos.